Hey you guys, it's Peter and welcome to my channel. Peter! Boom, 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 Review stuff. And yes, I am back for another Starbucks review. I actually was gonna do a different drink over here today. So let me tell you what happened. I am really, really obsessed with the oat milk brown sugar shaken espresso. But almost every Starbucks that I go to is out of it because apparently the brown sugar or something that these drinks have done so well that like almost every store is out of the ingredients to make it okay so when i was going through there i was talking to ben who is one of the baristas at my starbucks that i go to regularly and um i said you know when are they going to bring it back and whatever and he said well i can make it for you a different way and so he made it for me a different way and it was so good so if you guys want me to do that recipe i will do it uh, put it in the comment section below and i'll do that for you in the next couple days i'll find out which day Ben is gonna be here um, so that he can make it because it was like it had some chai in it and it had some uh, other things in it I don't know what the other the magic magics of the world because Ben is the magical barista <laughs> so anyway and Josh is still there too people always are like where's Josh where's Jake they're still there the everybody's still there so anyway today I'm going to review this uh, air conditioning is like shooting right in my eyes <laughs> it's like making my eyes water I swear I swear I'm not sad today now I'm in the happiest of moods. I don't know why. It's just like shooting right here. Let's move it over a little bit that way, a little bit that way. Okay, that's not much better, but oh well. You can get these. Oh, no, 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 no. That's not what I'm reviewing. It says you can get these naughty skewers uh, for roasting hot dogs and marshmallows, and they are hilarious. That is not what I am reviewing. Okay, I am reviewing that you can get a mini Mouse Rappuccino from Starbucks to give you all the Disney vibes. Okay, and this is by Holly. Is there anyone more iconic than Minnie Mouse? Um, Miss Piggy. <laughs> I think Miss Piggy is more iconic than Minnie Mouse, but anyway. Okay, other than Mickey Mouse? <laughs> I had to bring this iconic character to our Starbucks secret menu to add a fun treat to try. And first she puts a little picture of Minnie Mouse and then she puts a picture of the drink. And she's even got like a little Minnie Mouse thing next to her, okay? She's really stepping up her game. Holly, you're stepping up your game with the pictures. This is pretty and pink and packed full of flavor. This is definitely a drink you won't wanna miss, she said. And here's a picture of the drink. Just make sure you grab our recipe below because it's a Starbucks secret menu drink. Now, I will tell you guys, y'all know, hold on, let me put my sunglasses on. I am not a lover of the super sugary drinks or the frappuccinos. But because it's part of my job title as reviewer of the world, I will do it for you. Okay, because I know that you guys love the frappuccinos. I know you do, you write it, Peter. What happened to the Frappuccino reviews? We have to have the Frappuccinos and and please do cake pop reviews. I know y'all can't have enough sugar in your day. Anyway, <laughs> sugar, sugar, da 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 da. Ah, oh, honey, honey. But I just do not love the Frappuccinos. They're not like my favorite drinks in the entire world. I mean, every once in a while, I'm like, eh, okay. But even then, I kind of like more of a coffee tasting Frappuccino. You know, maybe throw in some. Uh, oh, I didn't even read the directions. Well, you'll read it when we get up here. You'll get it when we get up here. Um, you know, maybe a little mocha crumbles on top, you know, cookie crumbles or something like that, because this is the way the cookie crumbles. This is the way the cookie crumbles, see right here. But anyway, but I like more coffee-based drinks. And if I can't have a coffee-based drink at Starbucks, then I like the refreshers. But I really don't like the Frappuccinos. I really think they're like $8.00 and <laughs> they're just jazzed up sugar is what it is okay you know what i mean you know what i mean it's just it's i don't love them there's just i don't love them <laughs> i know some of you out there do but you're not really drinking coffee do you know that unless it has a coffee base you can get uh the, the frappuccino the but uh, you can get the regular base or the i don't know the coffee base but they're mostly they don't really they're not really coffee okay it's more like an ice cream after dinner drink is really what it is of the world <laughs> so anyway i know that your the kids are watching it and they're like mom i'm not drinking coffee shut up i just paid six dollars for your frappuccino six dollars my god some of them are like eight and ten dollars look at all these people out here not working smoking cigarettes behind the strip mall you better get back to work listen <laughs> If you don't have things to do, I'll find things for you to do. <laughs> that would be the surly boss that I would be. <laughs> oh, you don't have anything to do? You don't look very busy. I'll find some things for you to do. <laughs> oh, my God. 
back in the day we didn't have cell phones you know what i mean like that when i was working we didn't have cell phones when i was working in treatment but i can just imagine if we were all sitting out there you know playing well all the people that i worked with they wouldn't have been doing real exciting social media stuff they would have been playing candy crush for real though and i can just see my supervisor coming out there and she'd just put her finger along the station wall and she would have said hmm. If we have time for Candy Crush, I guess we probably have lots of time for filing and things like that. <laughs> I'm ready to get up here and order my drink. I'm ready for my close-up. <laughs> Here's my close-up. Are you ready for it? <laughs> this car, if they pulled up, just like literally one foot, which they could totally do, I could make my order. But I don't want to pull up there. This is this is the, the, the problems of the day. But I don't want to pull up there because if she doesn't pull up, that I'm stuck in between and then they'll start thinking that I can give my order and then I'll have to shout it and then she'll be like why are you shouting your order and then I'll be like because this woman in front of me and then she'll be like real not nice about it and then she'll want to fight me and I'm not a fighter I'm a lover so that's why okay I don't move up so anyway <laughs> oh my god who do you think the barista is today it's Ben Jake Josh, he's never usually the barista on the window anymore though. Or Veronica, I'm gonna bet it's Veronica. These people over here on the school, they're like throwing balls up against the wall. They're like shooting it way up and then I don't know what they're doing. It looks like they're doing some kind of conditioning or something because they're adults and but it looks kind of fun. Like, if that's exercise, I could totally get down with it. I'm not into that walking and running stuff, you know. I used to. I used to love to run. What is going on? Why is this taking so long? Oh, there they go. Okay. Veronica. Is this uh, Jake or Ben? It's Ben. Sorry, I was driving. Oh, Ben. Thank God. <laughs> What can I get for you? Well, you know what, actually. Oh, right. Oh, you know what? The brown. Oh no, 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 no! I love, I love both of you equally. Oh, okay, good comeback. Good comeback. The brown sugar oat milk shake and espresso is back. It is. It is. True story. Okay, can you? Um, oh, I was gonna have you make the alternative one that you did for me yesterday. I can still do that. Okay, can you give me a grande of the brown sugar oat milk shake? Uh, shake an espresso, and then can you tell me what the the second one that you made for me yesterday has instead? Uh, yeah, so the brown sugar oat milk espresso has uh, four pumps of the brown sugar syrup, but the, those four pumps are half pumps, so really it's just like two pumps. Um, and then the grande comes with three shots of the blonde, and also comes with oat milk. But then the version that I make has, if it was a grande, it would also have three shots of blonde, oat milk, but the syrup instead is, I like to do two pumps honey and then two pumps chai. Two pumps chai, okay. Can you make me one of each? For sure. Thank you, all right. All right, anything else for you? Nope, that's it. Sounds good, we'll have that for you at the window. All right, thank you. No problem. So I had to change it up at the last minute. We'll do the mini mass frappuccino another day. I wasn't really in the mood for that mini mass frappuccino anyway. You know what I mean? I really wasn't. I was like, oh my god, I was I was uh, wishing on a star. Is that, that the Disney thing? I was wishing on a star. Maybe something else would come along. And you know, then that happened to be Ben. And I was like, oh, this is perfect timing. So you know what? A real good YouTuber of the world. Okay, a real professional YouTuber of the world would go back and they would redo the video and they would drive through and they would do something different. But we're not doing all that over here. Okay, you. you you saw the title, you saw me start it, and you're like, what is going on? I'm so confused. But you know when you come to a Peter Review Stuff video that you're probably gonna get all kinds of mysteries and surprises and bells and whistles. It's better than a prank video, really, you know? I, it is, though, I mean, because you thought you were coming for the Minnie Mouse Frappuccino, but you know what, well, you didn't because the title's gonna be different. I don't know what I'm gonna make the title this one. But I'll be back in uh, just two and two. All right, it's my turn. Ben! The joke of the week. Not Ben. How do you clean a pig? Ham sanitizer. Ham? Ham sanitizer. Sanitizer. <laughs> Thank you. How are you, Peter? I'm good. How are you? I'm doing all right. We're getting through the day. It's busy now. I know. It's real busy.
You're never on the window. I know, I'm normally other places. I'm normally at work. Not today, though. Not today. Subjected to the window. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we'll have those things for you in one minute. Okay, we'll thank you. The okay. They got Veronica back here, busting her butt. She's running back and forth and she's putting all these drinks in there. She's making the drinks and she's doing it. Look who it is! Look, everybody will want me to say hi. Hi! Hey, is this, I'm not even, you have the shaken espresso? Two of them. Two of them, then you have the brown sugar, right? Brown sugar and then he's making me a special one. I see, I see. Okay, so he already, he's already got you running out, so I have the person behind you's order. So, well shoot, now I have nothing to do but hang out in the window with you, Peter. Well, How you been? Did I pay? No, I didn't pay. No, I think he got you already. He did? I think so. Well, that was nice. Thank you. Oh, okay. Right, well. How have you been? You know, I'm fine. We're kind of... We're kind of short staffed today, so other than that, though, this poor guy with our truck, nobody gave him a dolly, so he's bringing everything in by Aww. hand. Aww. Where's your fiance? He's in the back. There's a leak in the back, so he's very busy. Do you know which one this one is? This oh, is what's on the sticker? I didn't even look. Garlic, large, birch herber, <laughs> artana, and blonde. Frappuccino, that's the one. <laughs> that's just the regular one. This is the regular that's one that you can get. One. Okay. This is the irregular. Yeah. Okay. Thank you so much. Have a good one. <laughs> Have you guys ever tried to read the back of those cups things? It's like, <laughs> large, our, our, ostrich. <laughs> okay. So this is the special one and this is its secret. Okay. This is the real one here. We need to get it. I hope everybody's okay. But if they are, then shut up. I'm trying to. Oh, this woman's got her window down. She's over here listening to everything I'm saying. It is so hard to be famous. Anyway, okay. So, here's the real one. Can you the lighting is so bad here, you guys. I, do, where do I have to go? Where do I have to go for good lighting? Okay, we're going to move because I can't. <laughs> I've worked too hard for this. For it to be this bad. Oh, my Lord. My Lanta. Okay. I was reading this other one, and it was not by Holly from TotallyTheBomb.com, but it was by somebody else, and it was like, go to the grocery store and get a bottle of orange juice, and while you're at the grocery store, grab this, take these things to Starbucks, and it was for like a virgin Mai Tai, and I was like, why don't you just go to the grocery store and buy some virgin Mai Tai sauce? <laughs> That's a lot easier if you have to buy all these ingredients to take them to Starbucks. Can you imagine taking all these ingredients to Starbucks and being like, here, you're going to make this drink for me with these drinks that I bought. No, we're not going to do all that. Okay, so here is the original one. This is the oat milk brown sugar uh, express, espresso. Does anybody call it espresso? Don't do that. It's espresso. Okay, I used to do that back in the day. See? That's that one. Okay, and then this is the... No, this is... This is the real one, and this is the fake one. If you're gonna do the fake, do it over the top. <laughs> okay. And this one is a uh, uh, grande. No, this is the real one, and this is the fake one. Okay, the prettier one is the fake one. And this is, <laughs> God, they say the same thing on them. Okay. Um, oh, this is two, plump, uh, two plumps, two pumps of chai, and two pumps of honey, okay, instead. So, now, but now they have it, so you can get it everywhere. But you might wanna try the other one, because I almost kind of like the other one better, honestly. Man, I'm gonna be so wired with all this coffee. Woohoo! <laughs> Howdy! Okay, so this is the regular one. I've already done the review. Y'all know I love it. I keep on ordering it. I really like it. And this is the one that Ben made me with the two pumps of chai and the two pumps of honey. It's a little smoother and it's a lot spicier. You can taste the chai in it. It's so good. Oh, that scared the hell out of me. Oh, I scared the H-E double hockey sticks. I know. So it just kind of depends on what you like, you know? But if you can't get the brown sugar espresso, shaken espresso, then you can always get this one and just ask them instead. 
to make a grande iced blonde espresso with oat milk, two pumps chai, and two pumps honey. So there you go. And it's a little secret trick, all made up by Ben, right? <laughs> and you're like, and 5,000 other baristas around the country. Okay, so anyway, let me know if you've tried this, what you think. Do you like the brown sugar oat milk espresso? I love it. It's so good. So anyway, I love you guys. Cheers. And I will see you tomorrow. Bye.